Have you ever looked out at a stormy sea and wondered about the safety of ships caught in the middle of it all? Storms are a spectacle of nature's power, with crashing waves and howling winds. But there's another danger lurking within those dark clouds. Lightning. This leads us to a question that might surprise you. Do ships ever get struck by lightning? The answer, as you might have guessed, is yes. Ships, those behemoths of the sea, often find themselves at the mercy of the elements. While they are built to withstand fierce winds and towering waves, lightning presents a different kind of challenge. This, to understand why ships are vulnerable to lightning strikes, we need to first understand what lightning is and how it works. Lightning is a dramatic release of electrical energy in the atmosphere. It's a phenomenon that has fascinated and frightened humanity for centuries. But how does it work? Imagine the sky as a giant battery. Clouds filled with water droplets and ice crystals become electrically charged through the friction of air currents within them. This creates a separation of charges with positive charges typically gathering at the top of the cloud and negative charges amassing at the bottom. When the electrical potential difference between the cloud and the ground or between different parts of the cloud becomes too great, a massive electrical spark, lightning, occurs. Um. So why are ships sailing across vast expanses of water susceptible to these electrical discharges from the sky? The answer lies in the nature of electricity and the environment of the open ocean. Lightning seeks the path of least resistance to the ground. Seawater, being an excellent conductor of electricity, provides this path. Ships, especially large metal ones, stand out in this environment. They become the tallest objects around, protruding from the flat surface of the sea. This makes them prime targets for lightning strikes. The higher the ship's mast, the more attractive it becomes to a bolt of lightning searching for a quick route to the ground below. History is replete with tales of ships being struck by lightning. These accounts, passed down through generations of sailors, often speak of the terror and awe inspired by such events. One such story involves the American clipper ship, Young America. In 1853, while sailing around Cape Horn, the ship was struck by lightning. The bolt shattered the mainmast and set fire to the deck. Fortunately, the crew, though shaken, managed to extinguish the fire and save the ship. This event served as a stark reminder of the unpredictable dangers faced by those who dared to venture out onto the open ocean. Section 5. Faraday Cages, a ship's suit of armour. Knowing the danger posed by lightning, shipbuilders throughout history have sought ways to protect these vessels and their crews. Over time, they developed ingenious methods to mitigate the effects of lightning strikes. One of the most important safety measures incorporated into modern ship design is the concept of a Faraday cage. Named after the English scientist Michael Faraday, this protective measure involves surrounding the ship's sensitive areas with a conductive material, typically a network of copper wires or plates. This conductive layer acts as a shield, redirecting the electrical current from a lightning strike around the outside of the structure and safely into the sea. Section 6, Braving the Bolt. How ships handle lightning strikes. When lightning does strike a ship, the experience can be dramatic. A blinding flash of light is often followed by a deafening clap of thunder. The ship's structure may vibrate violently as the electrical current surges through it. Modern ships, equipped with Faraday cages and other safety features, are designed to withstand these forces. The electrical current from the lightning strike is channeled around the vessel's exterior, protecting the crew and sensitive equipment inside. The ship's navigation and communication systems may be temporarily disrupted by the electromagnetic pulse generated by the strike. However, with proper safety procedures in place, the risk of serious damage or injury is significantly reduced. Section 7. The Aftermath Damage and Recovery While Faraday cages and other protective measures have greatly improved the safety of ships at sea, lightning strikes can still cause damage. The intense heat generated by the electrical current can melt metal components, and the explosive expansion of air around the strike point can shatter masts and other structures. In the aftermath of a lightning strike, it's crucial for the ship's crew to assess any potential damage. This includes inspecting the vessel for structural integrity, checking the functionality of navigation and communication equipment, and ensuring that all safety systems are operational. 
Depending on the severity of the strike, repairs may be necessary before the ship can continue its voyage. Section 8. Modern Navigation and Lightning Protection Technological advancements continue to improve lightning protection for ships. Modern weather forecasting and monitoring systems provide early warnings of approaching thunderstorms, allowing ships to adjust their course or seek shelter in a timely manner. Sophisticated lightning detection sensors can also be installed on ships, providing real-time information about lightning activity in the vicinity. This information enables the crew to take proactive measures to minimize the risk of a lightning strike, such as lowering antennas and securing loose objects on deck. The combination of advanced warning systems and robust protective measures has significantly reduced the threat of lightning strikes to modern ships. Section 9. Conclusion, the enduring awe of lightning at sea. While the science behind lightning is well understood, there's still a sense of awe and wonder associated with this natural phenomenon. For centuries, sailors have shared stories of lightning strikes at sea, tales filled with both fear and respect for the power of nature. Modern technology has made ships far safer from the threat of lightning strikes. Yet the sight of a bolt of lightning illuminating the night sky above a darkened sea remains a spectacle that reminds us of the raw power of the natural world.